morning everyone and welcome back to a brand new vlog. Today I am off to IMATS. Um, I've been awake since 8 o'clock because I've been very excited to go to IMATS. It is now 10 to 10, I need, no 10 to 11, I need to get an Uber right now and get to the train station because my train comes in 25 minutes. I will show you my outfit and whatnot when I get there to the train station and I'll be with Bean as well. So see you then. Bye. It's Bean! Oh my God. You look so good. Like this lighting's really nice. Oh, the highway. Well, highway. Very deep. All you can see is like, <laughs> like a black square on my face. I can't tell why. It's like the focus of the blurs at the background. And then we got to the other B. I was going to say, do you not want to say anything? Or? Hi. <laughs> and then try. Hi. We're wags. Walks. Me and Bean had our little train journey. We are. Shocking trip of a lifetime. We pray, pray. Bean was in my vlog last year at IMAX. <laughs> I will put in like the screenshot, but it was her back, and now you've got her front this time. <laughs> well, yeah, we're about to eat and then go to IMAX. Going to IMAX. We everything and <laughs> so we's here. Um, Bean wanted me to vlog. What not? What the fuck not? This is what you say when you walk. Yes. Yes. Give it to me. Oh, there's a queue. Oh, so I haven't had a queue for a few years, if I'm honest. I think I had it the first time I came. Freshly raw, raw face. Um, it is 22 minutes past 11. Oh my god, I actually really look really rough. And I looked so pretty today as well. Look at me with my little I Met stamp. So we, well, I've just got back home um, from IMATS. We were there all day, basically. We got to London at like one. We left at half eight. Um, so we got to London, met up with everyone because me and, ugh, me and Saba both got a train. Ugh. Don't mind my pajama top, by the way. Like if it's got fake tan on, it's okay. Cause I sleep with it. It's like, yeah, it's fine. So me and Saba got the train together, um, because we're both like in the Manchester area. And then we met Amani and her friend Charlotte cause they live in Leeds. So they got a different train. We met them, we got the tube to White City and went to Wagamama's for lunch um, because we all like Wagamama's and it was Charlotte's first time at Wagamama's. She said that she loves noodles, so we thought no better place than to go to Wax. Um, then we went straight to IMATS basically. We got to IMATS about, ooh, maybe like 20 past, half past three-ish. Um, it started at three. So today was the Friday and today is the pro card day. So there was other discounts today as opposed to throughout the week. Um, and it's all pro discount today. Um, so we all had pro cards 
um, which is why I went on the Friday. And to be fair, like, I've always gone on a Saturday and I've loved going on the Saturday, but like, I just know how manic it gets. So like, we always had to go on the Friday. Um, anyway, so we went ham, you guys. We went batshit crazy. I spent so much money. So much money. Don't worry, you guys. You know I'm doing a haul. You know it. My yearly haul. It's, yeah, every year I do an IMATS vlog and every year I do an IMATS haul. So don't worry about that. Um, and yes, we just chilled on IMATS. I met one of my subscribers and I'm so annoyed that I forgot to get your name. I'm so sorry if you're watching this. Fresh face, you know me. Um, hello, it was so lovely to meet you. I'm really, really sorry I didn't get your name. Um, it was just so, lo yeah, it was really, really lovely to meet you. Like, I do meet quite a few of you guys. Like, I it always just, like, shocks me. Because, obviously, like, I'm not, like, a big YouTuber. And, like, it's just weird, like, when I meet you. I, like, fangirl over you guys. So, like, it was really, like, surreal. So, hello. Thanks for coming up and telling me. Um, anyway, yeah, so it was really, really good. Spent loads of money. And then we... I wasn't hungry and neither was Saba, but the other two were, so I think they went for food. Um, and me and Saba just kind of got the train back to Manchester because we weren't really hungry. Feeling a bit, like, sick, so I'm going to drink some water. I feel like I should need water and, like, fruit. Um, and I'm just going to sit and just, like, probably, like, plan some stuff for tomorrow. So tomorrow I want to do a lot of, like, youtube based stuff. So I need to edit a tutorial. I need to edit a clothing haul. I need to edit last week's vlog. I need to film my makeup collection. That's coming tomorrow. Well, that's filming tomorrow. Um, and I need to take some Instagram pics as well. So that's going to be kind of like my day tomorrow. Um, and yeah, so I will see you guys in the morning. Good night. Good afternoon, everyone. It is Saturday. It is 10 past two. I have been awake for ages, don't worry. I've spent two, oh, two hours, two hours filming my makeup collection. Oh my god, this is why I've been putting it off for so long. Because it's not a quick like, this is my foundations, this is my concealers, this is my powders. It is so in depth. Um, I need like a break from like talking and like looking at makeup right now for a sec. Um, yeah, I filmed that so I'm really really happy. So that's the first thing done on my list of things to do today. I've also tidied up the bedroom, I've folded away the clothes and put them away. And whoa, why have I gone really dark? What the hell? Um, and I've cleaned it. This spot by my mouth is disgusting, by the way. Um, I've cleaned the kitchen, done the dishwasher, cleaned the living room, all like that. So the house is in tip top condition. And I've just filmed that. So I'm very, very happy. Look at me in the background. I'm so happy. <laughs> um, I haven't eaten yet. And I've only drank a glass of uh, squash. And I've been speaking for two hours nonstop about makeup. I have got a headache. I am hot. I am tired. I'm thirsty and I'm hungry. So I've got a handful of swatches that I'm going to wipe away, get cleaned up and grab myself a drink and some food and watch High Oaks uh, just for half an hour. And then I'm going to crack on with the rest of my things to do. So I have to edit a tutorial, edit a clothing haul, edit a vlog, go to the gym, film makeup collection, done that. Take some pictures for the gram, edit the pictures for the gram, edit my collection, and then I'm done. So I've got a lot to do today. Um, and I just want to take like half an hour just to watch the, um, whatever that show is called now. Uh, Holly Oaks and just chill because I'm fucking tired. <laughs> Hi! It's half past midnight. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking give this <laughs> Say goodbye to him because you're never seeing him or him in my vlogs ever again. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. Um, I've just been editing all day. I've edited three videos. Um, I yeah, I've just been doing that kind of stuff all day today. Um, I've been chilling with Tom. We finally finished the Little Mermaid. We've tried it like three or four times, like quite a few times, and every time I've just fallen asleep. Um, and now we're about to watch some YouTube in the bed. Um, and I'm going to get ready to go to sleep. Oi, I'm here. Excuse me. Stop swearing. I'm trying to put my phone. I need to go to sleep because I'm going to get up early tomorrow and go to the gym. 
when I was editing the videos, I realized I haven't actually shown you my nails that I got done um, in the week. So this is what they look like. Ooh, kill them. After what you did. And the pinky, it's kind of like a pink to clear ombre with like blue and like iridescent glitter. That one's like a clear tip with like white outlining and like blue gems. That one is a blue to clear tip with like foil and glitter. That one's a clear to iridescent tip with gems. And then the thumb is kind of like ice cream slash marble. Um, shut the fuck up. I'm gonna kill this boy. Um, so yeah, we're gonna just watch some YouTube in bed. And then I'm gonna get up early tomorrow and go to the gym because I've taken my two days off, well, two days off for this week already. So I do need to go tomorrow. And then we're doing a counter move at work because on Monday we launch our new counter, which I'm really excited about. And Monday I'm filming a tutorial. I'm gonna go to the gym on Monday. I'm filming a tutorial. I'm filming a haul. I'm filming, that's it. Um, and then I've got work in the evening. And then Tom and I have actually got a day off this week together, which is really cool. Maybe Monkey Forest. Nope. But after what happened last time, Probs not. I do want to go to Blackpool Pleasure Beach though, so I might try and convince Tom nope. if we can go. He might say, yeah, we never know. Nope. Um, and yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys. Fuck off. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It is a quarter past 11 on Sunday. This is the most Mondayest Sunday I've ever come across in my life. Um, I've just got ready for work. I'm doing a look that's inspired by milk. I don't know his full at, it's like milk something on Instagram. He does like loads of face charts. You guys probably know who I'm on about anyway. Um, I'm doing a face, like a look based on one of his face charts because I fell in love with it. It's like a yellow in a corner and a blue in a corner. It's a very cool tone. I don't usually go for cool tones, which you guys probably know. Anyway, I'm ready for work. I've made my top kind of like a crop. I'll show you guys. If you guys can see, I've like, oh, I haven't tied my belly. <laughs> Whoops. I've like tied it up and I just feel very, I feel a little bit self-conscious, but I can't lie to you guys lately, like these past like three, four days, I have felt so good and so positive in my body. And I was just like, let's just tie it up, see what the hell happens. And like, I've, it's a long top anyway, so I can just make it long if I don't like it in the end. I was just gonna wear a normal crop um, top, but I thought no, because in case I do get too self-conscious, I can always make it long again. Anyway, I'm off to work now and I will see you guys when I come back. Oh my god, I swear, time just, time just like escapes me sometimes, I swear. It's like quarter to one in the morning. Um, I'm just chilling. I really don't know at work today. We were um, moving counters because we've got the new counter launch tomorrow, which I'm so excited for. Um, Tom's away tonight. Tom's out in Wolverhampton for his friend's um night in a club or whatever i don't know i know um so yeah that's pretty much what's going on i'm just chilling i've just been catching up with um hollyoaks and don't be tardy for the party but just don't be tardy tardy um i'm about to go to sleep because i'm up at, well not early but i'm up tomorrow like going to the gym and filming two videos, a tutorial, and my I'm at haul, which I'm really excited because I just wanna play with my stuff. Um, and yeah, so I will see you guys in, good morning. Good morning, everyone. Oh my God, it's so dark. Wait, maybe my camera. Good morning, everyone. It is um, 20 past 11. I've just come back from the gym. It's still really dark, isn't it? I don't like this light as well. I'm um, gonna have a smoothie, film two videos, and then I'm gonna make the salmon after that have it for my lunch and take it to work as well because i literally could eat salmon pasta pasta every single day all day and not get bored i love salmon pasta pasta so much uh, i'm so dehydrated like my mouth just feels like nasty because i'm like how dehydrated i am um yeah i just got back from the gym had a really really good session today sorry i ran out of minutes i don't know what i was saying last um but basically i haven't been for a couple of days because of my schedule um just with like work and like going to imats like had to get to london quite early and like all this different stuff um so i haven't been for a few days so it was just really nice to get back into the gym and i had a good session and yeah basically that's it i'm now gonna have a shower and then get ready and start filming. Um, so that is my plan. I always have something really exciting to tell you guys. One sec, let me just delete some more stuff because my 
flashing. Yeah, one sec. Like two weeks worth of vlogs on my memory card for some reason. Anyway, so got a really exciting call today. Um, I and Tom, well myself and Tom have a viewing um, for apartment that we really want. We've both been eyeing up like this set of apartments for like a few months now. Um, and loads of them like every day keep coming out to rent. I'm pretty sure it's a new build. Like I think there's a few blocks um, of them and I think the block that we're viewing, I think that's just like been really, like just newly um, built, which is why there's so many different apartments in that block to rent at the moment. So we're looking at one to rent, an unfurnished one, which I'm really excited about. I really, really want an unfurnished apartment. I've wanted one for ages um, because I just want my own shit. Like I have wanted an owl-shaped sofa since I can remember, like when my dad was alive, like that's how long I've wanted one. And I used to ask him if we could have one and he said, no. Um, so I've wanted one for years and I can finally get one if we get an unfurnished place. This is a really nice, it's really quite close to where we are now. So everything can stay the same, like our local shops can stay the same, our gym can stay the same, and it's just, just so nice. Like, I can see it from my building and I'm like, I wanna live there so bad! Um, so I'm really excited, we're gonna view it on Wednesday. I'm not gonna take you guys with me, just in case I don't get it. Um, but it'll be available to move in like mid-July. And our lease here ends at the end of August. So that's like a perfect time, especially if we're gonna get it unfurnished. Cause then we don't have to like move in and not have a bed or not have like a sofa for like however long. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. Um, and yeah, I don't know if you guys may be able to tell, like I, still, I saw it when I was editing my vlog. I can see a little bit of weight. Wait, well, like, yeah, like when I do that, defos. But like, I don't know when I was editing like last week's vlog, um, I could like see a difference between like a few other weeks ago and yeah, you guys might not be able to, that's fine. And you might be thinking that it's all in my head because I think it's all in my head. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go and have a shower and get ready to start filming. And that is Tom blowing up my phone. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys later on. Hey everyone, so I look different now. I've got makeup on. This is the look. Um, I've also filmed the haul that I needed to do. I'm just currently boiling the kettle, the salmon's in the oven, and I'm about to start cooking. Tom's asleep in the other room, so I should be quiet, but you know, you know I'm loud. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. No much else to say. My life's really boring. <laughs> I've realized how boring my, lives, my life is since vlogging. I do need to watch some YouTube videos though, so I'll probably be doing that. And yeah, that's my whole life. In a nutshell, in a vid, it's my life. And I have to work. Basically, is all I said, a little nap. <laughs> it was nice. I feel really tired and drained because of this heat. Today's been really hot and really stuffy. So, <sighs> wash me look. Oh my god, I'm roasting already. Good morning, everyone. How are you? I'm good, thanks for asking. It's, um, oh crap, it's 10 past 11. We've been up for a while. I assume you guys did. I feel really far away. Um, we've been up for a while, it's 10 past 11. Um, I'm just gonna start getting ready to film. I'm gonna film make look ups. Um, I think I'm gonna do like a really girly smoke. And by that I mean just adding um, pigments or glitters into it, because you know how usually when I do a smoke, I just do matte. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do that today basically. Oh, my hair is just playing me at the moment. Um, yeah, that's pretty much what's on my agenda. Work yesterday was good. Did I vlog last night? I remember coming home and I remember feeling really sick. And I'm pretty sure I was sick and then I slept. I went to um, TGI Fridays after work. I'm gonna put you guys on this side. I'm not used to talking over there. So we went to TGI's after work yesterday. It was really fun. A few girls from work went. Um, and yesterday was our first, well, my first day, well, the, the first day as well, on the new counter. The new counter's really nice more like advanced technology which is really cool and it's a bigger space which we're all very very happy about Anastasia launched as well so I had a little look at their stuff um their stand looks really nice to be fair but I, I think everyone like ev like everyone got a new stand and everyone's new stand looks really nice because obviously it's brand new and it's still sparkly and like clean and what have you so um yeah, but basically we all just went out for TGI's because um, at, at the moment it's Ramadan 
and a couple of the girls like obviously can't eat through their shift so um we went out for food so that they could eat um because obviously they could break fast at like half ten which is good oh i need to get the car fixed so the car is just screwed right now i think the bump kind of messed it up a little bit um so i need to get that fixed i need to call box all about that apart from that it's pretty much all but you guys will be here throughout my whole day don't you worry my hair looks crazy it's been in a bubble for like four days <laughs> i've just taken it out um so i didn't realize that i have seven videos okay my hair looks too crazy let me try and a cute make no it's not made it cute in the slightest so i have seven videos i have edited four um and i'm currently in the middle of editing another one um one's uploading at home so it'll take two days that will go live on Friday. That was what I filmed today. Oh my god, I didn't even show you guys what I filmed. We don't feel well. Like, I was getting such a headache and I want to vomit and everything. So I'm just gonna lay down for a little bit. I've been in front of a computer all day. And I've been like editing all day non-stop. And like, I went out for a little bit. I went for a little walk earlier just because I needed to just to get out. Um, my hair's like weird. Oh, I can't be honest. I'm gonna wash it tomorrow, so it's fine. Um, yeah, I just feel so like we're, but I'm so excited to view the apartment tomorrow. I want this apartment so bad. As far as I'm aware, I'm going to be the first person to view it. So I'm going to nab it. I'm going to be like, thank you, I'll take it. Um, if I like it, that is, obviously. Tom's going to come with me as well because he's got the day off, so I'm dragging him out. Uh, oh, I'm going to vomit. It's really nice weather again today. I've realised, well, I knew it already was, but I haven't seen it on camera. It is the one year since the Manchester Arena attack, um, which obviously someone who lives in Manchester, um, it's just, it's, it affected us so much. Like at the time I was living in town, very close to where it happened and I was working in town. Um, and... I remember the day like it was yesterday. I remember what I, know, I remember where I was when it happened. I remember what was going on. Me and Tom um, were in the living room, and he went, "Oh my God, there's been an explosion at the Amien Arena," and I was like, "No, there hasn't." And then I went on my Snapchat, and one of my friends from university, um, who worked in town, and she works really late. She works in like a, a restaurant. She put on her Snapchat, oh my God, I'm safe. I'm at home. Um, please make sure everyone else is safe. And I was like, oh my God, what the hell? And I logged onto Twitter and like Twitter was going crazy about it. And I just, oh my God, oh, I just. Oh. The poor innocent people who lost their lives for. <sighs> it's just really sad, like. It always just like and like you know when it happens so close like I know it's happened in London before and I've said well I said to Rose at the time I was like in London it just seems so weird because it's just so far away and London is so big but in Manchester they're so united here and like so like oh because it was just it happened to like kids like oh it's just it's horrid I've wanted to get a B tattoo even before it happened and after it happened, I really wanted to get one and loads of places were doing them and I just never got around to it. And it's something that I'm definitely going to get done. Um, because I know I'm not from here and and that, but Manchester is my home. So it's a year since the attack happened and I just... I just want everyone just to think about the families affected. You know, of the people who were even there, the people who never made it back and all like that, like... It's just so sad just to think about that. Oh. Oh, I don't like thinking about that stuff. It just makes me too sad. It's like a little baby. Oh, I can't. Um, but yeah, I, I'm just going to lie down for a little bit because I've got a massive headache and I just don't feel well at all. Um, and I'll see you guys when I wake up. And I'll see you guys when I'm a bit more alive.
and my hair doesn't look like this. I am awake. I had like an hour nap, which is nice. I feel a lot better now. Um, the second I talk about sleep or being awake or anything, I yawn all the time. My hair doesn't look better. Apologies. Probably looks even worse. Um, I'm going to get back to editing because I just feel really good that I've got like seven videos. It's like over three weeks worth of videos. Like that's just so good and like so, like I'm so happy for it. Um, and then I'm going to be filming on like Thursday. No, I'm not filming Thursday. I'm filming Friday as well. I've got two other videos to film on Friday. And yeah, I want to get back to three videos a week, like plus the vlogs, so four in total. But just with how shit my internet is, like I won't think I won't be able to do that until we move, basically, because of how shit the internet is. Um, but if you guys think that's too much, then let me know. Like four weeks, four videos from me a, vi a week is that too too much? I'm not sure. Like nothing would give me better joy than. Um, Um, <laughs> what? Yeah, nothing would give me better joy than just to even do like a whole like seven days of videos back to back to back to back to back to like make the fact of how shit I've been. But this internet situation is just so hard, like two days it takes to upload a video, man. It's just, and I'm not even joking with you, like it takes two days to upload a video. But in the new apartment that we're viewing tomorrow, I think the speeds are like 350 MB as opposed to um seven or nine MB here. So I can literally upload uh, a video in like an hour, which I've never been able to do before. Um, but anyway, that's enough of my internet rant, my daily internet rant. Um, I'm gonna finish editing. Mm. I currently have a face mask on. This is the one from MAC. I don't know what it's called off the top of my head. It's just a sample part, sorry. Um, and I've just cleaned the shower and the toilet to within an inch of its life. And I've got a wash on. I finished editing that video. Um, and yeah, I'm just trying to clean this bathroom. Like, it, it, like no, it's not. I'm not gonna say, I'm not gonna lie. It's like, un, it's, un, it's untidy as well. So I'm trying to sort that out. Have I even shown you guys my bathroom before? This is like my nice print from Decenio. And then a few pants. Hello, everyone. It's uh, 10 to seven in the evening on Wednesday. I'm so sorry I didn't film, like, film. I'm so sorry I didn't vlog this morning. We. Went to the apartment viewing, the guy went to the wrong place. So we've had to reschedule again. This time it's for Saturday. And then I went to work and I've just come home. I finished early because I hit my target. Oh yes, I was the first one to hit my target. So I did a little incentive and I got to go home early. So I'm home now. I'm just gonna rest up and eat a little bit. And then Tom and I are on the way to the cinema. We're going to go watch Deadpool 2 because we didn't go the other day um, after like our little crash incident. Um, just because I was a little bit shook up. So I had a little nap um, instead. So we're going to go today. And yeah, that's pretty much what's going on. It's really nice day at work today. It's such a nice day outside. Oh my God, it's like sun shining. Oh, it's so nice. So we're going to walk to the cinema because I just really want to I want to enjoy the sun. I haven't enjoyed the sun so far, so that's the plan. And I'm about to eat and drink because I'm so dehydrated. And I've got such a headache. I've had a headache for like four or five days now. <sighs> yeah, that's the plan. Hello, everyone. Good afternoon. Um, it's about a quarter past one. I've been to the gym today. I've just got ready for work. Um, if you guys are wondering, these bad boys are from ASOS. I just got an ASOS order. If you can see in the back. Um, and these were in them. They had 20% off everything the other day. So I made an order. Ups. So yeah, I'm after work today. Today's the last day of the vlog. How sad. I'm going to give you guys, well, I'm going to get Tom. And then we're going to give you a mini review of Deadpool 2. Tom. We told you to vlog. Just do a mini review of Deadpool 2. Okay, go on, go on, go on. How did you feel about it? About what? Deadpool 2. Yo, I enjoyed it. I thought it was, um, it was a fun film. I think yeah. it was a bit like, like... I don't know, I think there was a lot that was happening, you know what I mean? And I don't think the plot was as concentrated as it was in the first one. 
Yeah. Like, there was a clear goal in the first one to get back at Francis, you know, I mean, Ajax. But in this one, it's a bit like, whoa, 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 up in the air kind of thing. Yeah. Like, first it's Cable who's the villain, then it's Juggernaut and then Firefish. So I like the message that you can redeem someone, you know what I mean? I think like, Deadpool kind of comes to that conclusion. I don't think, spoiler alert, any Spoiler alert, guys, you know what I mean? <sighs> he comes to that conclusion via like, his deceased wife. But, like, Colossus and was trying to tell you that from the first film, you know what I mean? So it's a bit... I, I, I did like it, though. I did like the film. I thought it was fun. Ryan Reynolds is good. I think there's a lot of the jokes are kind of hit and miss. And you have to be kind of in tune with, like, popular culture to understand them, like... Yeah. But some ones have, I just I thought, like, what is that? Like, if you did a bit of research, then you probably might find it was funny. Like, I found... The fun, one of the funniest ones for me was... Um, <laughs> When he said a joke about Beyonce, <laughs> about, um, <laughs> like Beyonce says to Jay Z, <laughs> stop cheating on me. I can't <laughs> lie. I, I, I was creasing up at that one, but I think, yeah, there's jokes a bit here and miss, but like when they hit, they do hit. But it's, overall, it was a good film. It's funny. You know what I mean? It's a funny film, but yeah, and, uh, is it better than the first one? Probably not. Probably because the first one was such a revelation, but yeah. it's a kind of conti- of a continuation of that. I think the only thing is with Deadpool, he's become like more of a hero in this one. Where I think in the first one, he's like very much an anti-hero. You get me? Yeah. Like in this one, he becomes a hero. I would say, but does that does that fit what Deadpool is about? I don't know. You know what I mean? I don't know. Have to see ya. I thought he was just going to say it was good. <laughs> um, no, I, I enjoyed the film, to be fair. I like Deadpool. Um, I really liked the first one. I don't think it's as good as the first one, but I think it's quite different to the first one. Um, yeah, it's good. I think you guys should watch it. So watch um, Avengers and Deadpool. Recommend, recommended by Soph and Tom. But anyways, I'm off now. I will see you guys when I finish tonight. Um, Tom is making some dinner for us this evening. And then I'm going to edit this vlog. So... I'll see you guys later on. Are you naked on the top? Yeah. Copy yourself off. I'm proud. I don't want no one seeing you. Tom made us spag ball for dinner and it was delectable. Um, and now we're in bed chilling. We've had a really chilled out evening to be fair. What did we watch? The Great, no, The Mass Detective Down Under? The Rescuers. The Rescuers Down Under. <laughs> Is what we watched on our Disney film. We've been slacking lately because we keep starting them and then stopping halfway and going to sleep and then having to restart them because we were both so tired the day before that we forgot what happened. I think my order is top five, mm. Pocahontas, yeah. Peter Pan. Mm. I think I'm going to do it, you know. I think I'm going to put a sword in the stone in there. Really? I really like that film has a lot of memory for me. Yeah. Sword on the Stone, third place for third place. Fourth place is gonna be Ra- Ratatouille. I think that is a brilliant film. Absolutely amazing. And fifth place. I think there's, there's so many that are tied on fifth for me, you know. Moana's are tied for fifth, Tangled, Up, Wally, The Incredibles. Toy Story, Mulan, Hunchback of Notre Dame. I've got six tied at fifth. Okay, so like, out of the films you've watched so far. Yes. Which is top three? Out of the ones you've watched at, so far. Out of the ones you've watched top four, yeah. so far, Peter Pan, number, yeah. number one, yeah. without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah. Number two is going to have to be Sword in the Zone. Yeah. Number three is going to have to be Oliver and Company. Oh. Anyways, I will see you guys in next week's vlog. I love you. Peace. Peace out. A town. Do 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 do.